G'day guys, Wayne and Judy here from Down Under. This is the uh, Singer 319. This is probably one of our favoured domestic machines around about 1950s, 1960s. Um, really, really good machine, probably more 60s than anything else. Has the motor on the back. Just a very, very traditional. This is probably one of the more heavy duty varieties of the Singer before they went into the 400 series. Um, this is one we have a great loving for um, and strength oh, I've put a hundred and twenty needle in this and we've actually sewn some quite reasonable leather with it so this is certainly not an industrial machine but it certainly has capabilities of doing some heavier work so this machine here comes with this is the 319 it comes with a cam stack which is five of your basic stitches which is your scallops, your V, your triple step dome, your three step zigzag and just your straightforward zigzag. So this comes with a 309. It's set up at the moment for um, domestic thread. You can put upholstery thread through this so you can actually adjust it so it will sew with a thicker thread without no problem whatsoever. So this one here being on the motor and then the cabinet is quite good. You do get the cam stacks. So this here is a box of cams which come with it and inside that you've got about 26 cams. So out of the complete set of cams that there has I think it's 25 cams, but then you add these five cams, which is one, two, three, four, five to it, it then gives you the complete 30. So that is your 319. This will only sew as strong as the motor behind it. So we'll come over here and then we'll have a look at this little baby here. This is another one of our favourites. So this one here is the 306. So the 306 doesn't have the cam stack in it. So all your cams, all your fancy stitches are operated from basically these cams here. So we've got six of the cams which come in one of the packs. So this one here you can see again the two-tone brown and you've also got the two-tone green. So this one here we've actually treadled. So it's a beautiful solid machine, so we'll just show you, I'll try to as I go. So you can see there that's quite a sizable needle, this has got a 120 in it. So you can see what it's sewing there, there's three thicknesses of canvas. So this would be fantastic for the home industry. Actually what we'll do is we'll now put this leather through it. Sorry, I'm being a little bit skew if you're here and let's see how this goes through here. So you can see that It's actually sewing through that leather, the underneath of it. You can see it's a good stitch under there and on that and you, you can see what that leather's like. So that's quite reasonable. So this here is the treadle. I love the treadle because you've got so much more control with it. You know, and then we'll go to straight stitch. Gorgeous machine. Absolutely beautiful machine. Strong, solid, reliable. And you can see how good this one is. So these are two of them. The capabilities you can see here. Three thicknesses. There's four thicknesses. Four thicknesses of, again, canvas. So these are a really, really good machine. So there's your two-tone brown, which is a treadle. 
again, you'll probably sew thicker through that than you will with this motor. But these are extremely good machines. We highly recommend them. And um, we do move quite a lot of them on when we get them. We find them that they're extremely good. I won't call them industrial, but they certainly are a good heavy-duty domestic machine and we would highly recommend that if anybody's looking for a machine get something like this and um, get it up and running because these are far better than um, most that are on the market today. So that's Wayne and Judy signing off from down under with a little bit of a chat on the Singer 319 And the 316, amazing machines, highly recommended. Thank you, Wayne and Junie, siding off.